Hi guys, my name is Amir Shahzad and you are watching Amir Shahzad 216. Uh, today my video is about the circle, how we can draw circle in total station TS09 plus. Uh, in the morning I visit my site and one of my surveyors is draw this uh, rim. This rim number is 8 and they, he has uh, this uh, some points. He make uh, this circle in uh, 16 arc uh, portions. So each quadrant he divide in the fourth portions. So actually uh, I want to try to explain this one on the site but the site was very noisy. So that's why I'm trying to explain in the office. Because he already marked that time this uh, on the site so easy to explain but I will try to explain in here in the office. Uh, in this video I will uh, explain uh, in TS09 how to draw this complete circle. And if you see the total station TS09, when you power on this instrument, you can see display look like this. And then you can see there is a, in the middle there is a program. And uh, when you reach on the program, just hit this program button. Or otherwise you bring your uh, cursor on the uh, required folder. For example, I need a program. So I bring on the program. And press OK or otherwise this press the 2 button. So I press 2 and then I am enter the next uh, inside the program. There inside the program there is the option survey, survey plus, uh, reference EL and road. So for example uh, I will I, I need to draw a circle like reference arc. So in the third one there is a reference EL. So this one I can change from here on the page button and also I can choose this keys and also with the touch screen. So I will enter the reference arc and then you can see there is a more option will appear. Uh, for example, there is a description. The description is define a reference arc stake out and check the point uh, relating to the arc. So if I cho uh, choose is the second option configuration, there is a configuration. So in configurations you have a three options f1 set job f2 set uh, station and f4 for the start job actually if you have a new uh, if you need to make job you can make but uh, in my case i will not make any job and i did not set the station setup whatever station i already have set i will use same so i will press f4 for continue so reference arc you have uh, some more options like uh, center and start option and then you have a uh, start and radius and then if you have a uh, three points of arc you can draw arc my required is i have to draw a complete circle so in this case i will use center and start point so i press f4 for continue when I will press F4, then the next uh, option will come uh, in, uh, appear on the in front of me. So there, if you see, there is a uh, first is polar and second is measure to the center point. So first, I have to give the center of circle. If you see the sketch here, a uh, given uh, center of circle. So first, you give the point ID. And then search the ID. For example, I will give the ID 00. And then I press OK. And then this arrow key. And then F1, I will press for find. There is no ID for the same numbers. So what I have to do, I will press F4 for continue. And then I have to press. F4 for E and H. So I will give him no center of the circle. In my page, I have a center of circle, this one. So I can write same center of circle. Two, four, six. Wait. Two, four, six. no no 317 next 
थ्री टू सॉरी थ्री टू एट पॉइंट थ्री टू सिक्स थ्री टू सिक्स सो हेयर आई पुट द सेंटर ऑफ द सर्कल एंड देन प्रेस ओके आई डोंट नीड टू मैंशन एलिवेशन हेयर बिकॉज आई नीड टू ओनली ड्रा द सर्कल सो आई विल प्रेस एफ फोर फॉर कंटिन्यू सो सेंटर ऑफ सर्कल इज स्टोर्ड बाय द नेम ऑफ जीरो जीरो Uh, it's automatically he asking me the first starting point of the circle he give the id 01 and height of reflector is 1.3 so what i will do i will press again f4 and then f1 for the find so there is no point number 01 so same i will repeat again same procedure i will press f4 for enhs so i will give the uh, east north and height so in the circle what he draw I have a this number one, so I will give this number one. So tell me the string. Two four six. I will press two four six. Seven. Two times seven. Mm. Point. Zero six eight. Zero six eight. And then press OK. And then F four for the continue. So here I have a fix my circle. So in the second third appearance you can see reference arc over already we already have a set. Though so start point name is zero one and center of circuit point ID is zero zero. So he give us automatically the radius. Radius is fifty one point two five. and the arc length this arc length is the whole circle length 322.01 if you see the page i have written here the uh, per, uh, for the perimeter 2 pi r if you apply this formula you can find same distance 322.01 so here then you have a more option stake and measure points what is the different between these two actually for the major points you will just mark point any place is not a specified distance so stake is you can divide in the required distance for example here he make this uh, one uh, segment in the four parts so if i use this one so what i will do i have a total arc length total circle length uh, this is uh, perimeter so this is 322 हर करी तीन सौ बाईस हजार पंद्रह वन फाइव डिवाइड बाय सिक्सटीन बिकॉज वी आई एम गोइंग टू बी डिवाइड इन द सिक्सटीन पार्ट सॉरी सो वन आर्क लेंथ विच वन रिक्वायर्ड इज ट्वेंटी मीटर एंड थर्टीन पॉइंट थर्टीन सेंटी एंड फोर मिली सो फॉर द फर्स्ट पॉइंट आई विल गो टू स्टेक so then we have a four options the general method is the stake out point stake out arc stake out uh, chord and stake out angle now because we are going to be a mark point on the arc so i'll press f1 for the stake out points so here automatically he gives 02 id and then the line and offset line is the arc length what we are required for example this one from the start point from 0 so we divide this whole circle in that uh, 16 pieces so first uh, arc segment is 20 point sorry stake out and then i will bring on the line so i will give the length of uh, arc 20 point 134 134 37 four. and then press okay and there down side is offset if we need the offset we can give offset but if we need the same circle to draw so we'll keep this one as a zero so i'll press okay so he this instrument asking me the rotate of our instrument in 174 degree 40 seconds so 40 minutes and 4 second and this point is from the instrument 46.48 distance so in this case you can draw the whole circle 
with required distance so i can go by the escape back so here you can change your distance you can whatever you are required you just simply put the distance of arc required distance and then you can go to continue and you have an option and make this horizontal hz in zero and simply press distance for the major uh, points for example uh, i will now change my uh, this uh, prism mode i will bring into the non prism so i'll just shut the wall in front of me what is looking as you can see it's showing me you will rotate your uh, instrument 174 degree and the point will be 44 i will rotate i will show you So important thing you can bring this one in zero zero and then press F2 for distance. You can find in the yellow side one millimeter you need to right side and the 44.702 meter backward. So this is the way how we can draw the circle. So I will repeat again I will press escape for the go back. Here you need here you put the distance I mean line of the arc how much required and if you have an offset offset you can also put so this is the way how we can draw a circle with the Leica total section TS09 when we have a center of circle and one side of circle are required so hope hopefully I will clear this one if you have any question regarding this video you can ask me in the below comments I will reply you within 24 hours thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe my channel.